Windows NT 3.1 is the first version of Windows NT, a new branch of the Windows operating system that Microsoft began developing in the early 1990s and targeted exclusively towards businesses. Windows NT was a purely 32-bit, MS-DOS independent version of Windows that was designed to be compatible with a larger range of hardware, specifically processors, as well as to provide greater stability and security. This was at the expense of higher system requirements and increased system resource usage. For these reasons, Windows NT was initially positioned as a high-end operating system, and one which was not designed to replace MS-DOS based versions of Windows, but rather to supplement them. Windows NT 3.1 was released on the 27th of July 1993 and took both its name and user interface from Windows 3.1, the then current version of MS DOS based Windows, released around a year earlier on the 6th of April 1992, and which had helped Windows to become an established brand in the world of desktop operating systems. Even though Windows NT 3.1 was designed to look like Windows 3.1, under the hood it was a completely different operating system, and introduced many features that are still fundamental to Windows today, such as the NTFS file system and registry editor. Windows NT 3.1 was met with a somewhat negative reception. The system requirements were deemed to be extremely high for the available hardware at the time and well above the average computer's configuration, and complaints were made about the operating system being generally slow to use, as well as the scarcity of 32-bit programs to take advantage of its new capabilities. Support for Windows NT 3.1, like its MS-DOS based predecessors Windows 1, 2 and 3, ended on the 31st of December 2001. 